All right, it's Brett Hamilton back here at JNR Music and Computer World in New York City. I've had a Canon digital camera or an SLR since the D30. Then we played around with the 10D, the 20D, 30D. I also own the 40D, and today we've got the 50D from Canon, which is a huge upgrade from the 40D, and of course continues this excellent line of Canon digital SLRs. Now I mentioned that I own the 40D, and this looks a lot like the same camera. Well, it's basically the 40D body with a new 15 megapixel sensor that Canon rebuilt from scratch, from the manufacturing up to the photo diodes. The result, well, better looking images, cleaner images, less noise at a higher resolution. Overall, I upgraded because the image quality was worth it. Another big change is the new high res LCD screen. You can see it right here. You've got an LCD screen that's three inches, same as the 40D, but it's got a resolution of 920,000 dots with three anti-reflective layers and a high-res live view. That's great for knowing what you're going to shoot before you even shoot it. Taking a look under the hood, this 50D is impressive with its 15 megapixels. And I mentioned before, it's got a Digic 4 image processor. That's a step up over the Digic 3 that you found in the 40D. Also, high ISO up to 3200. It's got face detection. Something they call peripheral illumination correction. It's a big word, big phrase, but it basically helps you correct for the specific lens you're shooting with. What this will do is it maintains the evenness of illumination in each corner, which is something you had to fix before, after the fact, or in post-processing. You may notice when you're shooting outdoor landscapes where the blue sky up in the corner looks darker than it does in the middle. This fixes it based on your lens profile. There are 26 lens profiles included, and you can even add up to 14 more. It's a really innovative feature, and I did notice it helped when I went from a 16mm lens to a 70 by 200 lens. The 50D also features a built-in flash that's right here, 9-point autofocus sensor, and for me, one of the greatest features of all time, sensor cleaning. This used to drive me crazy, but Canon has solved the problem with their integrated cleaning system, which has a fluorine coating, better for resistance to dust. The self-cleaning sensor has a filter in the front and it's a front sensor that vibrates at a high frequency at startup and when it shuts down. I've tested a bunch of different lenses. So far, no dust. On the top is the hot shoe for your speed lights. You've got a control wheel, which as many of you know, lets you get into the functions and the settings. It also has an HDMI output for displaying high-res photos on a high-def TV. If you've got a plasma, LCD, you can take them directly from here and watch them on there. Here's a slot for your compact flash card, which we recommend uh, an 8 gig UDMA card. Along with the camera, you've got the lithium-ion battery, which is inside, charger, USB cable, and video cable, plus the software, a neck strap, and even an eye cup. I told you that I've had the Canon SLRs for years. Every year I upgrade just because I'm, I don't know, always looking for the latest and the greatest. But the 50D is worth getting for the upgrades it offers. I think the Digic 4 processor alone was worth the price. You combine that with the new integrated sensor cleaning, you've got the 15 megapixels and the new LCD, I was sold. Peripheral illumination, also an amazing feature that I didn't think about until I tried it, and now I don't think I'd shoot without it. Overall, Canon has made some significant improvements, and those of you that have the 20, 30, or 40 Ds, you'll be really pleased that you've made the jump. And even if you've never had a digital SLR, this is an incredible camera for the money that'll give you shots similar to those that were only available from high-end pro equipment up until now. Get yourself one by calling JNR Music and Computer World, 800-806-1115, or anytime on the web at jr.com.